here with this week's player profile for the Lady Lions with point guard Alex Bentley. Alex, talk about the, the first couple of games of the year. 2-0 and start, great win down in Dayton in overtime, and then a big win on Sunday afternoon here. Talk about those two games. Um, the Dayton game was uh, really exciting. I mean, we went into double overtime, and um, a lot of our shooting guards um, stepped up and hit some, some really, really great shots. So um, it was nice just having a, a balance, balance uh, for, for the score and just all across the board and the box score. So this is your second year leading the offense at the point guard spot. How much more comfortable do you feel today versus this point last year? Um, I definitely feel a lot more comfortable. I mean, it comes with the experience. Um, I have one year under my belt, so, I mean, this year's it's a lot more fun, I think. What's been the biggest challenge to getting to this point right now for you? Um, I would say just fitting in, trying to fit into that um, point guard position. I mean, there's a lot that goes into it, and, um, I mean, it gets hard at times, but, you know, I'm starting to uh, to really get it. Looking to go 3-0 and against Oakland. What do you know about their team and looking forward to that game? Um, they're a pretty good team from what I from what I know, from what I hear from last year, you know. Um, it's not going to be an easy win, um, but I know that we we can definitely beat them if we if we come to play. Switching gears a little bit, what got you into basketball originally, and how old were you? Um, I just love basketball. I mean, right when I touched right when I touched the ball, I, I fell in love with it. Um, and that was probably I was probably like five years old, six years old, something like that. So your home state, obviously known to be a huge basketball state. What's what's the basketball culture like in Indiana? I mean, it's great. Everybody loves basketball. Everybody loves to watch it. Loves to play. Um, I mean, it's a great atmosphere for the game of basketball. Any reason why you picked your number, 20? Um, I just love the number. I mean, it's a great number. My dad, actually, um, he played in the NFL, and he was actually number 20. I don't know if that has anything to do with it, but I've always liked the number anyway. Who do you look up to in the basketball court, professionals or you know, other college um, players? I really have a lot of love for Kobe's game. When you look around the, the locker room, who's the biggest competitor on the team? Uh, me. <laughs> I've I've heard that, and why is that? Um, I don't know. I just love to compete. Um, I hate to lose, and I love to win. It's just how I am. When you look on the schedule, the Bryce Jordan Center are playing host to the first and second rounds of the NCAA tournament. How much of an incentive and motivation is that for you? Uh, it's a huge motivation because we don't want to be, you know, not playing in our home gym, and um, I mean, it just gives us a lot of motivation because we want to play, you know. And it's here, so it gives us a an advantage. Point guard spot, obviously a difficult position to learn, but having Coach Washington be a former point guard, how much has that helped you in this, this process? Oh, it's great. I mean, she knows a lot about the game, and I just try to soak up all the information that I can from her. Have you ever played her in one-on-one? -on -one? <laughs> no, she won't play. She won't play anymore. So this year, what, do you, what types of goals, expectations do you have for yourself moving forward? Um, for myself, um, I just really want to just lead my team to, to victories. Um, whatever that takes, I'm going to do it. All right, Alex, thanks for your time. Best of luck this week. Thank you.